Assalamu alaikum, this is Shafiq Fazaldin and Joe Alaska reporting live to you from the Dubai Unity Game 2015. We're here with the two stars from the Dubai Falcons team who just came off an exciting 2 all draw against the Stanmore team. So, Brother Joe. Brother Tuff, yes. what an intense game. Twice taken the lead and twice Stanmore, you just came back. Was it an unlucky night for you? I mean, you came up a very tough game today after against Dar Reds. Yeah. And uh, that was even a tense one all draw. But your team is beginning to gel, the players are playing, but something, some aside, the chemistry is still missing. What do you feel it is? It must be like, it's actually, it's all about time. Normally, it takes a week or two to gel up, but we don't have enough time. But seeing the way we are playing right now, it's just, it's just the second game right now. So, it's probably it'll take us a day, uh, you can say, by tomorrow it should be fine, and we should perform. Do you feel hopeful to be going to the cup event or the plate event? In your own all expect. I think we can make it up to the cup and we can actually win it if we turn up. So you have three crucial games tomorrow. A victory is needed, at least two or one, to make sure your passing is through to the cup. But saying that the team is playing very well, I can see the players are fighting. And hopefully the way you get forward as Dubai Falcons, the whole Dubai is behind you. Brother Listen, over to you. You know, we have, we have noticed, and I have noticed personally, that you guys have a great team, a team full of stars, and you being one of the midfield stars in the creative mind. Something is lacking out there. Can you give us your feedback on I mean, What do you think needs to be added or can be implemented to you, for you guys to, you know, better your uh, I think we had a good okay, we're going to uh, games. games. Uh, we just need to focus a little bit more. On attacking, we're playing very defensive because in both the games we took the lead. And when you take the lead, immediately you get the mindset that let's let's start defending. But uh, by the time they scored, it was uh, it was very late in the game. But we did push up. I think by the third or fourth game, like the last mentioned, we were hopefully we'd be ready to enter the cup, not the play. <laughs> Finally, there's a breaking rumor that you two have been seek, hidingly and seekingly being tortured by Dubai Gisses. Anything you'd like to add on that rumor? Actually, not really, but yes. Uh, they have actually challenged us, firstly. And they hope to actually move further than us. Then they think that we are going to go in the plates and they are going to go to the cups. But it's going to be the other way around and that's for sure. Are you trying to push your own transfer through today? <laughs> Not really, but I think we have a way better team. Just, we have a lot of potential. But they are not a bad team, but in the end, we have four stars with us. Keep that in mind. Brother Alisson, what do you have to say about this? Have they approached you or is it a silent thing between you and Altaf? Well, I mean, we, if, if they did approach us, we're going to find out by tomorrow. But if they didn't, you'll see us in the cup. That's Final all I thing say. is, Tomorrow is the Boxing Day, all teams are playing. Do you think Leicester will still have it to win and stay on top of the Premiership? Or do you think Arsenal might just pick them tomorrow and start the new year being, being top three? I'm putting my money on uh, Leicester. Yeah. Same. Totally. I like the underdogs. Brother okay, Ali, there you have it. Brother Ali Zain and Brother Altaf, thank you very much. This is Brother Shafkat Fazaldin and Brother Jawad Askar signing out. Unity Sports 2015. The